Welcome to Making More Movies, episode number 8. Sorry, episode number 9. Uh, today I want to talk about something really inspiring. And that is uh, the fact that, and I didn't know this, um, I just found out today, uh, there is a Uganda film company that makes, you know, very low budget films called Wakaliwood or uh, Ramon Film Productions, which is so funny because Ramon is the name of my grandfather, so uh, who is still alive, so that's uh, wonderful. <laughs> um, the thing is that I didn't know this, uh, this guy uh, who is the founder of Wakaliwood um just makes this feature uh for less than 200 bucks you know less than 200 bucks um what caught my attention uh was the fact that uh the simili similarities with this uh film studio uh, with my own film studio, which is uh, Battle Film, which is, you know, it's a, a film production company that uh, we specialize in making genre films and exploitation films. You know, we bring you the wildest and most exciting, entertaining experience that you will get in your entire life. Okay, we are very unique. Uh, I mean, if you are a fan of uh, genre exploitation movies, you will love us. Uh, but, you know, the thing that we have in common with Wakaliwood uh, is not only, you know, the raw passion to create and make films uh, no matter what. Uh, you know, we don't wait for the money. Uh, I recently hear, uh, heard an interview that he made uh, with uh, Alex Ferrari. Uh, a couple of years ago, um, and you know he uh, he basically said like it is uh, without any you know euphemism, you should not wait for the government or anybody to give you permission to create. That's uh, a very stupid. Uh, strategy and what really bothers me uh, profoundly is that you know in my home country Argentina uh, especially in my hometown Rosario a lot of people just you know a lot, I will say the vast majority of filmmakers the mainstream filmmakers they are financed by the government. They wait for the government to make, you know, to give them the money. They might find other, you know, uh, investors, but there's always the government. There's always, you know, the big daddy government ready to give you money if you make the things that they want you to make. Um. The funny thing is that the best filmmakers are not, uh, you know, uh, they, they don't receive money from the government. Uh, there's this production company that's called Punch Cine, uh, founded by my great friend Celso Florence, which, uh, you know, they, they make great content, great, you know, short films, but they are not... They don't receive, you know, subsidies. They don't receive money from the government. Uh, at least that I know, uh, at this, you know, date, to this date. Maybe in the future they will. Um, but they're great. They're bizarre, weird. Mm. They're uh, a little bit more uh, mainstream uh, for my taste. I, I, I usually make really... Uh, exploitation, uh, you know, films, we make uh, uh, exploitation genre ideas, but, you know, it is what it is. 
And uh, you know, going back to Wakaliwood, they, god damn it, they, they make films with nothing, and they make it. Um, I was, uh, I watched, uh, you know, um, ah, Black, uh, Bad Black, and you know, the first ten minutes, that was a blast. That I mean, and you know, it it doesn't it doesn't look. Uh, like Hollywood films because it is not a Hollywood film it doesn't look like a art house European film because it is not an art house European film it looks like a Wakaliwood production and you know uh, our films our productions our web series they look like you know, Battle Films production is a brand. Everything is a brand. As you know, everything that you as an independent filmmaker uh, do should be approached primarily as a business, as a brand. You are a brand. You should build your audience. These guys, uh, they build their audience and they and they made a lot of money. Uh, a lot of money in the sense that you know. They they did a crowdfunding a campaign, uh, expecting to get you know uh, one hundred and thirty bucks, and they got like thirteen thousand dollars, I guess yes, and they used that to you know, uh, not only finance their <laughs> uh, uh, four next films, but also to buy you know hard drives and. Uh, computers, you know, updating their software. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's that shows the power of building a fan base, a following, uh, because their movies uh, are once they, you know, they uh, end their selling phase, they become free on YouTube. You can go watch it right now. Uh, Who killed Captain Alex? Bad Black, which, uh, to my understanding, uh, it's uh, their best film. Uh, I haven't watched all of them. Um, the passion, the passion behind this, you know, company just uh, makes me see that what I'm doing is the correct thing. You know, I'm I'm building the brand. I'm building my business and I'm building you know my future doing what I love to do okay even if right now it's hard and it's a hustle and you know uh, it's not perfect I'm going to be in that place I'm going to win because I'm doing the work they are doing the work You need to, you know, uh, Chef Bezos say it. You need to watch yourself at 80 years old, looking in the past, and imagine what will you regret, okay? What will you regret? I will regret not having my own film production company, making the kind of films that I like to watch, um, you know, making a living with that selling ancillary products, selling online courses, uh, teaching people how to make it, and, you know, offering entertainment, uh, you know, providing value, doing what I love, which is, you know, what everybody wants. Every same person wants to do what they love and, you know, making a living with it. Even if it's not a luxury living, no, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, I mean, like that really inspired me uh, because I'm. We are basically from the same crop. We are doing the same, different outlooks. Uh, you know, different inputs differ. 
different story and you know different results but uh, we are building a, we are building an audience and you know they have been doing for I guess more than 10 years so they have a huge audience um, I recently started so uh, I, I can only imagine what the future you know uh, is waiting um so yeah go go look uh go go look that you know go go uh, wakaliwood productions official wakaliwood is the channel and go watch some of the films uh watch uh the interview with uh, alex ferrari in in the film hustle um uh, and go make things go create your films or whatever art you do <laughs> 